everyone, my name is Morgan and welcome back to Dandelion which is brought to you. So a lot happened in the last episode. Um, a lot of painful things happened in the last episode. But maybe the painful- oh, who am I saying? The painful things aren't gonna end because he's gonna leave in two months, but... I think Gion's is done being an asshole, so <laughs> we're at least moving on from that pain. Are we still gonna have to leave to go to Seoul or is like that off? I've seen a lot of you guys wondering like, how do we- how do we go from that to romance? Um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not too sure. We're, we're gonna find out together. I know for me personally, let's just say that I took Hee Jung's place and was in this situation. Maybe at first I would be very like confused and upset by why Jion was treating me that way. But then I think afterwards, <laughs> I'd been like, you know what? Screw this guy. Like forget him. And I would have like shit talked him with like Jisoo and Jiwoo or something. <laughs> like Hee Jung held on to Jion for months. I, he's, he's been treating her poorly for months at this point. I'm not gonna judge her for, you know, acting that way. Everyone responds differently to this stuff, I suppose. But I know I, I, I probably wouldn't have held on that long. I would have been like, what the hell was wrong with this guy? But that is not what happened and now we are here with Dion. He's back. We probably could finish the route in this episode, but I don't necessarily want to because then it's probably gonna be like stupidly long like the last episode was and I don't want it to be that long. But enough of my rambling, uh, I'm gonna hunt down this cat. At least I don't have to worry about running into anyone else. Hey there. Oh, not show love. Okay, I'll, I'll try it. He didn't like it, right? I I'm gonna see if he liked it. The blue hearts usually mean no. Don't forget our promise. You have to remember, okay? I forgot the promise. I'll be honest, I forgot the promise. Sit here, I've been waiting for you. What are you gonna do if I change into a bad kitty? Yeah, don't change into a bad kitty again. What is a bad kitty, you ask? Uh, should I explain this? Okay, yeah, he did hate it. I'm quick loading. <sighs> Curses. Oh, Chion. Here, Jug, here, Jug. Look, I want to show you this. Ta-da, they're slippers with cat heads on them. Aren't they cute? I want you to think about me when I'm anywhere, anytime. If you were, if you were to wear this and look down at your feet, you'll be reminded of me, right? Well, thanks. I guess I. I wanted to talk to you, but. Okay. Gian. Hey, Jug, you were in your room. I'll sit quietly next to you whenever you have, whenever you have to work on something. I want to spend as much time as possible with you, so I'll behave like a good cat. You could have spent a lot more time with us if you didn't spend months being mean. I'm- I'm gonna quick load though, because that gets me no points. Gian. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna ask you how you feel. I was thinking about the future. Should I change my hairstyle? Sit here, I've been waiting for you. The time I get to spend with you is like a dream. I'm so thankful for even the little things we do together. You've been home for a day. <laughs> I want more memories with you. You could have had more. If you, if you didn't act like that for months. I get there's probably some deep-rooted trauma in your past. But... He really is just back to normal now. I'm gonna ask how you feel again. I'm thinking of what I could do for you. Yeah, I already read that dialogue. Alright, let's go out. Where to? I, I think everything's new. Let's go to the movies. Did you reserve the tickets in advance? He... You want, po you want some popcorn? Choose whatever you want. I like anything. So, so you're not gonna pretend that you only like oranges now? <laughs> Every time I see this movie, I just... That looks like Juman Han. <laughs> it just looks like Juman Han and the main character that game. You jug. I... Uh, okay. Quick save. Huh, what is it, Gion? Oh, the flash from the movie. What? Let's see. What Can you hold my hand? It's dark, but I want to feel your warmth. I don't know what that other one meant, but whatever. Would the names go up at the end? I wish the movie would have been a bit longer. Does it feel sad when it says the end? Like at the end of our routes? I actually don't even know if it says the end at the end of the routes. Ha I don't even want- 
I don't even know what the movie was about. I was too busy watching you. Walking with you like this makes me very happy. I'm worried that someday this happiness will be gone. It will be. I just can't. Look. I just can't. It's hard for me to take this seriously when I know you spent months avoiding me and now you're like, I wish that I had more time with you. And it's like, you could have had more time with me. At least you're available both days of the weekend now. I don't think you're going to leave the house anymore. Um. Uh, let's... You wanna go to the park? Yes, I wanna go to the park. <laughs> he answered my question. That was weird. If only I could stop the season from changing. If time passes like this, I... Again? You wasted months of time! Your eyes are so pure and beautiful. Oh, are we like a thing? I don't think we've established that. Uh, thank you. You have beautiful eyes too, Gion. What if, would he like it if I complimented him? Really? That if we were to get married later, our children will have beautiful eyes. Uh I can't tell. I think we're a thing, but that was also never really established. Okay, draw. This must be how the color of the sky looks in your eyes. It's beautiful. I wish that we'll be able to stay together forever under this sky, but... I'm gonna leave. I know I just got back, but I'm gonna leave soon. Uh, I'm going ahead. I'm going ahead of you? What are you talking about? There isn't much time left now. I want to stop the clock, but... I really wish I would have come back sooner. Because as soon as I came back, I realized there's no time left. Gion, stop it! I can always tell when I go in a room that he's about to pop up because I can't, like, select anything. And there's, like, a slight pause. He junk, he junk. Are you going to take a bath? Can I take it with you? I, If you use my orange scented shampoo, you'll smell like me all day. Why are you embarrassed? You used to wash me and everything. You're not going to wash me now. I thought we established that, like, when you first became a human. I'm going to quick load because I need to get points with you. Oh my god, he's going to do it again. Ah. <sighs> A four-leaf clover is supposed to bring you good luck. It took me so long to find this. Okay, well, I'll keep this one because you gave me a present. Let's make a wish that the two of us will be happy like this forever. Okay, Gion. For the love of God, stop popping up when I walk in rooms. There you are. Okay. How do you feel? Yep, you already said that. You want a drink? I'll take it out for you. When summer comes, let's get a whole bunch of ice cream. You're not going to be here when summer comes. And go on a trip together. Let's take lots and lots of pictures, too. He You're not going to be here, though! Okay, okay. Could you, are you going to finally tell us about your past? Gion hasn't been going out since he came back. <laughs> I need to maximize my time with you. I realized I made a mistake. He used to go out a lot before, making different excuses. All he... All he does is to all he does is eat oranges and watch and watch TV these days. <laughs> so he's still eating a bunch of oranges though. A pile of orange peels on the table. I miss that a lot, but now that I'm seeing it every day, it's not very pleasant. What should we eat for dinner? <laughs> oranges. No. Since there's since there's only two of us, I let Gion choose the dinner menu. Beef steak. Oh, now you're gonna let me do give you steak. Gion acts cheerful, but he doesn't try to be cute anymore. <laughs> That's just how he is now, I guess. The difference is, Gion's become more honest. And I believe that this is the real Gion. Not too cute, but not too serious. Still seems pretty cutesy, though, to me. But he still looks adorable to me. Hey, you're heavy! He's clinging on to me again. I want to let you cook now. Why? You don't like the movie? No, I like watching you wearing an apron more than watching television. Aren't we like newlyweds? Are we even a couple? Did you even ask me out? I blushed. Newlyweds? I felt shy. Gion stared at me intently as I cut the onions. <laughs> don't cry from the onions. Ow. The onions are making me tear- Ah. Oh. I was telling that to Gion, but now I'm the one that's teary. You must like me so much that you are getting teary. 
No, it's the onions. I like, I like them cut small. I thought <laughs> I read that wrong. And at first I thought he said that he liked the smell. <laughs> I don't enjoy the smell of onions. I kind of don't really like onions in general though. Hey, you just want me to suffer, huh? <laughs> I've suffered plenty enough already thanks to you, sir. Although my eyes hurt, I couldn't stop smiling. It's like a dream. Jihan is back. The others aren't. Hey, Jug. Being with you right now is like a dream. I was just thinking the same thing. What a coincidence that we had the same thought. I'm just going to grind these onions with the blender. Are you going to make onion soups? Aren't you supposed to be- Aren't you supposed to make some steak sauce? Whatever. My eyes hurt too much. I'm just going to grind them. Where did I put the blender? I searched the cabinet under the sink. I'm certainly a happy cat. I heard Jian's voice behind me. I began to feel shy again. I'm so happy that- I'm afraid that this happiness won't last. Because it won't. Because you're gonna get poofed away. Here it is. I put the blender on the table. Jian. Yeah? Do you want to go to Seoul with me? Wow, really? That I, I can continue to live with you? you? You know that you're gonna be gone. I'm not together. I have to be with my mom. But if you want to come to Seoul, we can see each other whenever we want. What? I can't live with you? Why? I have to live with my mom. Screw her! I know she gave us money. Look, Jian, do you still have those $500 checks? Pay my mom back! And then I won't have to leave. Then can't three of us live together? I think Hyejung's mom would kill him. <laughs> what? That's nonsense. I don't think Hyejung's mom would be happy about any of the boys. I feel like Jion would be one of the ones she really wouldn't like. Mom and Jion in the same house. No way. Oh yeah, I have to pretend to be a good little kitty if your mom mom's with us. I don't want that. Good little kitty? You know, I can't do... <laughs> okay, we're doing with the censoring again? You know, I can't do beep and beep to you like a bad kitty. Did his words just get censored? In real life? What did I just hear? How, how can he actually say that out loud? Now I know that it, that mom and Jian living under the same roof should never happen. Jian, where did you learn those words? He was committing, like, <laughs> acts of robbery. Of course he knows bad words. No, the rabbit and the other girls. What other girls? What other girls? That's inappropriate. Don't use them. Whatever. He jug then. What? Then do I need to say goodbye to all the girls I've dated? Yes. You have. You haven't left the house, so you haven't been seeing them. Bitch. Sir. All the girls. Yeah, the victims of my player days. <laughs> that's what, that's what you're calling those days. Your player days. The victims of your player days. Those poor girls. <laughs> I wonder how many. And what does he mean by his player days? Oh, I think you know. You witnessed it. Why did you date them? You didn't even like them? The question that I've been wanting to ask finally rose to the surface. They just bought me expensive food and gave me allowances. I think you need to apologize to them. Allowances? Yes. Now I remember. A bundle of checks in Jion's wallet. Oh, I, I haven't forgotten. That has been on my mind this whole time. You're worse than a gold digger. Yeah, you're right. Okay, you admit it. <laughs> okay. Okay, Jihad. He responded with a bright smile. He just, I actually have a be better idea than going to Seoul. What is it? Living here with you. Like now. That, that is a better idea, but... You want to pay my mom back? With your checks? I would like that too. But... You're going to your mother's house because of money. I actually have a lot of money. This is what I've been saying. How many episodes have I been saying that Jian has $500 checks and he should use it to pay the money? Is he actually going to do it? Are you actually going to do it? What? Really? Yep, hold on. He took out his orange wallet. Oh, that wallet. See? This is a VIP card. What's a VIP card? 
Then he pulled out more credit cards with an innocent smile. You could have paid the guy back. You could have paid the guy back! You... You... Whose credit cards are those? It's quite a bit of cash. No, I don't need to see it. I'm sure he got the money in an unrightful way. So you don't have to worry about money. Call your mom and tell her that you're not going. I should have paid anyway. Thank you for admitting it. <laughs> Thank you for realizing you should have paid the money. <laughs> he really just had the money and didn't pay it. Oh, I thought the game was just going to like ignore that and sweep it under the rug. But no, he's aware. You really have that much money. Yes, I do. If I add up all the money I got from those girls... Uh, I sighed heavily. You really need to set things straight now. Jion, will you promise me one thing? That you'll never get money from another person or steal it? Oh, and you can't see other girls anymore. <laughs> Normally it's the guys being like, Don't, don't date other boys! But this time he was like, Don't date other girls! I don't want to see him with other girls faking his feelings. Okay, I won't. I will be a good little kitty now. And one more thing. <laughs> He's so happy. I remembered something he said before. Everyone who was kind to me all ended up being miserable, so I was scared. That you'll end up being like that. But if you come any closer, you too will end up being miserable. Yeah, that. What kind of com ca karma? That was not the word I was looking for. What kind of trauma? <laughs> How did I get karma out of trauma? What kind of trauma does he have that made him think that he had to treat me like garbage? I don't want him to feel insecure. We should both make our efforts to be happy. Don't worry about becoming miserable. And let's make an effort to be happy. Okay. You should no longer do such misdeeds. I want to make him happy. Okay, I promise. I felt shy. Hijug, I'm so happy. Seeing Jion happy made, also made me happy. Everything about Jion is so adorable. Have I fallen in love? You're the only one who has trusted me and made me so happy. For the first time in my life, I have a belief that I could be with another person. I, can, can we elaborate on that? Why do you think you can't be with other people? Because right now I'm feeling very kind of conflicted. I'm like, that's, that's sweet. You guys are being very sweet to each other now. But I also can't forget when you choked me out! You've chosen me, and I don't want to let you down. Choose? You jug. Huh? What will you do if I suddenly disappear? <laughs> Again. <laughs> what? This is such a random question. What does he mean by suddenly disappearing? There's only one answer. It's obvious. I'll go look for you, of course. You've been gone so many times before, I'll just go look for you. <laughs> She's like, I've been through this already. Okay, I know what to expect. You really do that? For me? Of course. From now on, I'm going to do my best to stay together. Will you promise me that too? Huh? That you'll continue to make an effort for us to stay together? Jian continued to ask like a little boy. Will you promise? Yes, I promise. You promised? Yes! <laughs> How many times are you gonna say it? I can't trust you. Come here and pinky promise with me. Okay. Have you been fooled all your life or something? Yeah, I've been fooled a lot. I'd like to know the details. He stuck his tongue out at me. I took off the plastic kitchen glove and Pinky promised him. Cross my heart and hope to die. Stick a needle in my eye. <laughs> You're like a little kid. Hey, it may be childish, but I have to make sure. Anyway, you have to keep this promise, okay? Okay, okay. I made, an eye, co I made eye contact with Gion, who was sulking a bit. From now on, I'll make an effort so that we can stay together. Which means I'm gonna make a, wis a wish to the wizard. Wherever we are, no matter what. Oh, okay, I thought- I <laughs> See, I thought that was like the start of a sentence. And it was gonna continue. <laughs> That's what I said. I sort of set, read it like it was the start of a sentence. And then it just ended. <laughs> it very, ended very abruptly. Hey there. I'm just gonna keep asking you how you feel. Because that seems to be the most effective right now. I was thinking about the future. Yeah, you already said that. You're cooking for me? When I see you cook for me, my heart warms up. I'm so happy that I'm feeling teary. 
Am I cutting onions again? Hey, let's go to the art gallery. I can get inspired. Sure, are they having a fun exhibition? So the theme of the, of the exhibition is love. This is so romantic for you to bring me to a place like this. Oh. Um. Isn't this piece wonderful? Yeah, this one. It's such a beautiful painting. It reminds me of you. Get inspired. Do you have an idea for your next piece? <laughs> Did you get inspired? Gee woo. I hope I can see that painting. I wish I would be able to see all of your paintings. But I've got to leave. Hey, Jug, are you happy? Now that I'm not being mean. Hey. Can I hug you before we go in? Aw, that's cute. Ah, uh, one more point needed. Okay. One more date then. Let's go to my school. Okay, if you won't go anywhere. You're graduating soon. How do you feel? I don't know. I don't think Heejung has discovered she wants to do art yet. Heejung, I... Quick save. Uh, what? Spending time with you like this, I... Never mind. I'm just glad to be here with you right now. Both of these responses seem the same. What's wrong, are you? I really like you. He... I like you so much that I can't even express my feelings in words. I don't know which one was better. When I see you paint, my heart aches for some reason, despite how happy I am. Do you paint a lot? I know that you'll one day paint great pieces. You should be an artist. Lucky go while holding your hand can't be any better. I wish the clock would stop. Well, it's not gonna. You're gonna poof. Okay, his points are maxed. Gian, I was trying to study. What'd you give me this time? A, a photo frame. I'll put a picture of us in it. <laughs> you should put our picture in here. That's what I said. Even if I were God, you could look at the picture and not forget that I was here. Would the picture still exist? The wizard wouldn't poof the picture, would he? Oh, hey. What? Are you kidding me? I could hear Mom's furious voice over the phone. I'm sorry. So, what are you going to do? I'm going to stay here and study for now. <laughs> I, I take it we sent her the money? Uh, you should know that the standards there are very different from Seoul. If you stay there, you'll ruin your life. I'll ruin my life if I live with you, bitch! So you're going to prepare for law school there? Now, art? Have you decided on art? Then? Oh, that's not what Mom wanted. I've watched just I've watched decided my path. I can't talk today, apparently. I've decided my path. I'm going to study art here. Yeah! She did it! I know it's not what you wanted. I don't want to hear it anymore. You're not like my daughter anymore. I gave up on being the daughter you wanted me to be a long time ago. Ooh, get her! That's right, Hee Jung. Oh, you can't be serious. Instead, I'm going to do what I want to do. Not you! Do what you want to do? Do you think that'll that it'll be easy? You know what? Go ahead. I've put so much care into you and this is how you repay me. I don't even want to hear your voice. Don't call me ever again. I don't want to hear your voice. Mom, I know you're angry, but you must be furious, but don't turn your back on me. I needed a lot of courage to tell you this. Please don't. The words I wanted to say are at the tip of my tongue, but... She's a bitch anyway. I'm done. Look, this is the third time we've had to stand up to your mom. I'm done with her at this point. She sucks. I bit my lips as I heard her hang up on me. It's all okay now. I told her what I wanted to do, so I'm okay. Even if she disapproves, it's okay. You Jug, are you okay? As I put the phone down, Gian asked me with a concerned face. Yes. Did you argue with your mom? Yeah. I can't really say that we argued. Are you and your mom on bad terms? No, it's more like... Well, I guess we just don't get along, maybe. Don't get along? Yeah. I can't be the perfect daughter that she wants me to be. And she won't accept the fact that I'm changing. I put the phone down and threw myself on the, onto the sofa. He just- ladies shouldn't just plop down like that. I'll do what I want! Don't tell me what to do! Men shouldn't choke women out! 
and rob them of their money. I'm sorry. <laughs> Look, I, I like Gian a lot as a character. Would I pick him as my boy? No. <laughs> but I still like him as a character, you know? I could think a character has done bad things and still like them. Like Jisoo. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna train you to become a lady. Sir, I'll do what I want. I couldn't help laughing. You're not a lady and you're going to train me to be one? Yeah, you know, I'm good at acting. Oh, I'm aware. Ah. Uh, still, I envy you. Why? Jen looked down with a sad smile. Because you have a bob. You don't have one? Oh. Is it was that the old lady or is she like your grandma? Jen's comment was heart raised heart aching. <laughs> Does he not have a mother? Do you surprised? I thought he had received a lot of love from his parents because he had such a cheerful character. Now that I think about it. The the line Oh. Yeah. Here, the parents support you with everything. With education and allowance. I thought we were going to flash back to the line where he's like, Everyone who I come in contact with is miserable. Press, we only care about survival. He had told me that before. I was alone from the beginning. So you were an orphan? Yes. I can't imagine. We're finally getting his past? Is that what this is? An orphan? Growing up without a parent must have been so hard and lonely. I had a hard time even with my when my parents got a divorce. But having no parents at all. I was with a group of bad cats since I was little. Bad cats? Yeah, cats like me who were abandoned lived together. I had to learn to pickpocket and steal as a way to survive. That's why you were so used to pickpocketing. Then why did you have to do that even here? I was desperate. For what? Jian looked at me guiltily. I felt like a burden to you, so I went, wanted to get my own place. Ah, okay. Jian. I told you, the more you get to know me, the more miserable you'll become. So all those misdeeds were to get away from me. I was afraid of you being nice to me. At first I thought I would be able to stay here longer if I act cute and all, but all of a sudden I began to like you being nice to me. I liked the way you treated me with no prejudice. I was acting all wrong, and yet you truly worried about me. You always cook my favorite food for me, and you listen to my concerns. And I... I... I held Gion's hand. Gion, it's okay. I don't want to hurt a good person anymore. I don't want to make you miserable. Gion, I've been curious about something. Why would you think that I would become miserable? That's what I want to know. Give me the juicy details. Why would being nice to Gion make me miserable? I want to know why he believes so. That's... He hesitated. If it's difficult, you don't have to tell me. Gion took out something from his pocket. Oh, his wallet. The picture? I remember Gion being furious at my opening his wallet without permission. He took out a picture from his wallet. Yep. Neko, old lady. It's the picture of that old lady. Who is it? I like the way Gian looks in this picture. I don't know, just just an observation. If he keeps her picture in his wallet, she must become she must be someone special. The first person to ever be nice to me. He suddenly looked very sad again. Oh, you're gonna hit me with this song? Oh shit. <laughs> We're getting into it. I used to have a close friend. A friend? Yes. We grew up in the same cat gang. <laughs> cat gang. His name was Kane. We were of the same height, and our pickpocketing skills were about the same. We both had no families, and got along very well. We did a lot of shameful things together. Kane was really ambitious. He even wanted to stage a coup against our boss when we became, when we became strong enough. <laughs> the cat world's dramatic. It's like a TV show, uh, or a novel. He jung or a novel. For the first time, I opposed him. Our boss has been taking care of us ever since we were young. But Kane didn't listen to me, and eventually betrayed our boss. He's really something. Uh, although he's my friend, he had changed too much, and we were growing up. He had a glum look on his face. So what happened? I got hurt trying to protect the boss, and 
I suddenly became one of the targets of Kane's gang. Cat gangs was not what I was expecting. Then I realized that there was no one I could trust. Ed. Oh. Okay. Oh, flashback! They're still chasing me. Over there! Shoot. I can't run because I injured my leg. I have no choice but to hide in that house. And my voice is still cutesy even though I'm a bad cat and a bad gag. Is anyone home? Who is it? Hey, you. Keep your mouth shut if you don't want to get hurt. What? I can't hear you. I'm just assuming this is the old lady. I should hide myself first. Huh? Oh my, who are you? Hey. Oh, okay, this- I'm assuming this is Kane. Hey, have you seen an orange cat? I'm sure he came this way. He's a bad gangster cat. What? I can't hear you! Did you not see a cat? Cat? Oh, a cat? The orange cat with spiky hair? Shoot, the old lady's gonna blow everything. It is the old lady. That way! He ran up the hill! The hill? Okay. Young man, are you okay? Uh, yeah. Th thank you for helping me out. I think they're all gone now. Anyway, I should get going. Why don't you just stay for dinner? Did she make steak? Is that why you like steak? What, did she give you oranges? What? Are you sure, lady? If they find out that I'm here, you won't be safe. You really resemble my son, young man. Your son? I've- Oranges, there it is. I've saved up some oranges for my son when he comes back. At least have some of those. Oranges? Who would eat those? <laughs> you. No, I'm leaving. You'll be in danger if I stay- Ow! Young man, are you okay? Your leg is bleeding. You can't walk like this. This is my generic old person voice, isn't it good? Just stay here until you get better. When your leg recovers, you can leave then. I was able to feel the feeling of having a family because of her. She gave me warm meals, a cozy bed, and unconditional love. She gave me everything that I've ever that I've never experienced before. Hearing the story made me want to give Gion a big hug. I had no idea he had such a tough life and cat gangs. I should have left when my leg recovered. But I was so attached that every morning when I would wake up, I would just tell my I would tell myself just one more day. Granny, I'm back. Here. Here, fish. Oh my, where did you get this again? Did you steal it? No, I became friends with the girl at the fish market over the hill, and she gave it to me for free. So that's where you learned that. You must be a real charmer. Last time, you got something from the fruit store for free. I must be good at talking with girls. How are you feeling? Me? I'm well. You've been coughing since last night. You should eat well. Don't you worry about me. I don't have le much left anyway. Hey, you don't say that. People like you should live long. You're the only good person I've met in my life, so you have to live long. I'm gonna leave soon, but you have to live long to meet your son. You're not going anywhere. I'll be alone again, thinking about my son. Don't say such things and think of here as your home. Granny. From now on, this is your home, okay? Granny, you have to live long. Granny, what is this? This must be a dream. Granny, this is a dream, right? Oh, shit. That's not good. No way. What happened to her? Uh, oh, okay. Haha, -ha, I knew you would be here. Kane, what did you do? What did I do? Can't you see? You're speaking as if you've never seen a house on fire. Don't you remember? We used to always set houses on fire. Ah! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> it's our pastime, you know? We would just set houses on fire. You. I'll never forgive you. Oh, and just what are you gonna do? Granny, bring her back. Have you gone crazy living with that old lady? Have you seen anyone dead come back to life? Ha! Is that what his wish is? If he has something against me, then you shall take it me. Why? Why did you kill an innocent lady? She she was waiting for someone. She has to be alive. 
She was waiting for someone so dearly. Bring her back to life. Cade, I'll never forgive you. Never ever will I forgive you. I, yeah, I, I take it that's probably his wish then, is to bring Granny back to life. Gion, who looked as if he was holding his tears back, lowered his head. There was no story yet. Of a, this was no story of an ordinary teenage boy. I swore to take revenge on him. I hated him so much for killing Granny. I could not do anything but, li but to listen to him. His wound was just too deep for me to simply say I understand. Now I kind of know why he didn't trust anyone, why he's been tricking people. I thought I would be able to tell this story. I would never be able to tell this story to anyone. I promised to myself that I would never trust anyone. And that I would never hurt anyone nice. Gion slowly lifted his head. He jug. He looked at me sorrowfully. I... I... Gion's eyes became teary. I'm afraid that you'll become hurt because of me. I'm so afraid. Well, Kane's not here. He can't get me. I'm so afraid that it's driving me crazy. What if something happens to you like Granny because of me? Then... How will I forgive myself? Jihan, it's okay. Even if I tried to comfort him, he wouldn't let go of my sleeves. He's been feeling insecure this whole time. He was afraid because he was worried about me. Jihan was worried about me the whole time? Like I was worried about you! The reason why he tried to draw a line between us, the reason why he yelled at me to leave him alone, was all because he was afraid that I will get hurt? I mean, Kane's not here. He can't hurt me. He jug. I'm sorry for being so harsh to you. I'm really sorry. You know I didn't mean it, right? I don't want to let you go. I... He grabbed my sleeve tightly. I want to stay with you. And just like that, the wall between us came down. I can't imagine how lonely and hurt he must have been all, the, all this time. Trying to push me away, feeling insecure, pushing me away and away again. It must have been so difficult and lonely. You promised, he jug, that we'd be together. That we'd be forever. To that we'd forever be together. That was a weird way to word that, Gion. Yes. You can't change your mind. Never. Okay, I won't. No matter what, if we wish, desperately, we could be together. <laughs> you starting to think up your plan with the wizard? Okay. Don't forget me. Even if I disappear, you must come find me. Okay, I will. Gianna asked me to promise many times, and I couldn't do anything but to say yes. I promised to myself from now on I would spare no love to Gian. I would take care of him so he wouldn't be worried anymore. I wanted to make him happy. To make him smile. I truly did. And then the day ended. Okay, well, I think we're going to go ahead and end that episode here. Um, and then we should be finishing his route in the next episode. Gian, he's a very interesting character. I, I do enjoy characters that are like, get away from me. I, anyone who comes near me, misfortune, like, falls upon them. I kind of think of like, uh, if you played Fire Emblem Three Houses, that's how Marianne is. So I do feel for Gion, and he, he definitely has a lot of trust issues, thanks to uh, his good old buddy Kane there. I, I get him being like, worried that if he gets close to Heejung, then someone will hurt her. But it's like, Kane's not here. <laughs> But you know, that's just not exactly how trauma works, I guess. I still don't approve of any of his actions that he did. He is certainly not the boy that I would choose. <laughs> we all know the boy I would choose. But I do still like him because he is an interesting character, honestly. I may not approve of the things he did, but I think he's very, very interesting. I'm a sucker for morally gray characters, like if they do bad things, and it's like, here's the reason. I, If you watch my video where I like rank my favorite characters, most of them, <laughs> Most of them are pretty morally gray, you know? So, Gion is definitely an interesting character to me. He did worse things than Jisoo, but I think I gotta put him above Jisoo, honestly. Like, Jiwoo is- he's the untouchable god of this game. No one will ever come close to him. I love him to death. Um, but in terms of, like, ranking characters, I I'm putting Gion at my number two now, I think, instead of Jisoo. I know Gion did, like, arguably worse things, but it's the fact that he's just a much more interesting character to me than Jisoo. I still like Jisoo, but Jion, like I said, I love a fascinating character that I can, like, try and understand them, like, why they did the things that they did. And that's what he is. Don't approve of his actions, but I think he's a neat character. Anyways, 
I'm gonna go ahead and go. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you're excited to finish up Gion's route in the next episode. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.